Hey guys, hey everyone, how are y'all doing out there? It's your girl Twin D. Thank you so, so much for stopping by the channel. If you never know, now you know, guys, it's me, it's Twin D. And thank you all for being here, my long time subscribers. Big up on yourself, my new subscribers. Welcome to the camp. I appreciate you guys so, so much. And thank you for appreciating what I do here and for depending on me for your messages. I promise you, I will definitely try my best to help you as much as I can. All right. So let's jump right in and let's see what's going on because this is a 911 emergency message. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. All right, and if you're new here, guys, my 911 messages, these are messages that God sends to me, and I have no idea what they are. As the number says, 911, they're emergency, which is something for somebody to know right now at the time that I receive it, or sometimes at the time when I get to deliver it. Oh, God, forgive me. <laughs> but anyways, oh, look, things are falling out already. All right, so let's see, let's see what's going on important message for someone out there so listen up it could be for anybody all right father god what is this 911 message about what is it that we need to know please father god what is going on what do we need to know please you have the ace of pentacles in the reverse and the four of cups in the reverse somebody feels like they missed an opportunity Someone feels like they missed an opportunity. Someone here is not feeling too well because they're also short on, on money. So this has something to do with somebody's um, financial um, status here. And also like just this feeling of I've lost. So whether it's them losing money or losing someone. But at the same time, what's happening here is like this person is getting over. Yeah, you have the, the, the page of pentacles here. It's like this person is getting over that loss. It's like they're no longer focused on that I have lost, if you understand what I'm saying. The loss is still there, but they're not focused on the negative side of that loss, which is the loss. What they're doing now is making these plans to improve everything in their life. They're making changes. So instead of sitting down and looking at, oh my God, I've lost, I've missed an opportunity to be the one that I want to be with. I've lost my money. They're no longer focused on that because that doesn't help nobody. That don't help no one. All you do is sit down and murmur and, and all be sad all day. Nothing. You don't get nothing done. When you By the time you quint, it's like 10 o'clock at night and you just woke up. Because you wasted your whole time thinking about what you don't have. That's why God says to appreciate what you have. Because they would notice that they're sitting on a couch. They would notice that they're watching Netflix. They would notice. <laughs> it's not me. It's not me. <laughs> they would notice that they're still breathing. The positive sides. So let's see what's happening here. Yes, look, look. I tell you, I can't lie to you. Not with God messages. Messages. I can't even talk. Something needs to come out here. Let me let me go through this thing here. So this person, like I said, they're no longer focused on the loss that they had. They're no longer. So now they can see that ray of sunlight through the dark clouds. Now they can see their happiness because now instead of sitting down and focus on what they have lost or what's not there, they're now focused on what they can do to change that situation. And they're making these changes. So whatever is happening now, they're allowing the wheel of destiny to turn. This happiness that they're looking for, longing for, this transformation they're going through is their destiny. They know it. This is my destiny. I've got to face my destiny. I can't let negative situations stop me from moving forward. All right. You have the three of cups in the reverse and you have the temperance energy in the reverse. So this person had a lot of insecurities here. And that's one of the major reasons why whoever this, whoever this person is, was so much focused on the loss in the past because they, it seems like they thought that loss that they lost was their everything, their perfect opportunity. They thought this 
thing, person, job, whatever it is they were hanging on to, was their perfect opportunity. Then come to see it's not. It wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't. So now it's like I didn't miss an opportunity. It's like this ending gave me a way to transform. Gave me a way to make my life better. Who's ever masculine this is? This person is growing. This person is growing. They're coming into their masculine energy. This person has been down. They've been sad. They've been... I don't know. But even with this temperance here in the reverse, this person didn't know themselves. This person had no control over themselves. They, they allowed so much insecurities in their life. But the best part of it is that they're transforming. And here you go again. The death energy. They're transforming. It's a brand new person that's coming in towards you now. Now they're realizing like the only opportunity I missed is to be with the person that I truly love. It's to be with the person I truly love. And here you have the five of pentacles. So now it's like they're feeling left out in the cold. Or they were feeling this energy again because they felt like they missed this opportunity. And for some again, I said it's money issues for some. So they may have lost a job. They may have lost money. And they felt like they couldn't move. They couldn't do anything. But a sudden change happened. A sudden change happened. Yes. They found themselves after all. After all. So it's like this person has finally realized like what kind of life am I living? Am I living my life or am I just living life for what I can get? This person has gone through a massive change. Whoever these masculines are or if it's one person, I don't, I don't know. I'm just delivering messages, man. What about this um, Ace of Pentacles in the, re in the reverse here? Why do we have the Ace of Pentacles in the reverse, please, Father God? What's going on here, please? What should we know about this? Jesus. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So we have the Ace of Swords in the reverse. And you got the two of cups in the reverse. Like I said, for some of you guys, and it seems like this is a majority. These divine masculines here, they felt like they lost your connection. They felt like they lost you because they were focusing on an on, on opportunity that they thought was their opportunity. When in fact it was not. You were their opportunity that they lost. Some of your divine masculines here, they were, they were telling some lies to themselves with this ace of swords in the reverse. They were telling themselves some lies in regards to this connection. Like I said, it's like they were forcing themselves to remain where they were. Because either they were already there or they felt it was better for them than with you. However the situation may work out. You know, you know, I don't care how, how it works out as long as it works out. But it seems like there's no more love in this situation. Your, your masculine is finally seeing that they've been lying to themselves about that connection, whatever that connection is or was. So now your person is getting out of this energy. They, they have healed. They're coming forward, the four swords in, in, in the reverse. They're no longer again sitting down and crying, guys. Like I said, I made a mistake. The grass is not green on the other side over there. Yeah, look. So it's like they, they gave up the Ten of Cups for the Two of Cups. Can you imagine that? But now they're seeing it. They couldn't see it before because they had insecurities. How can you see something if you're filled with darkness? I don't understand. And you can understand better. In regards to what this twin flame connection is about. Your divine masculines were filled with darkness. Their insecurity is that worst darkness that they've ever faced. So even though you came along. Look I'm seeing 10. Even though you came along. With everything that they've ever dreamed of. I already have something here. Or 
my parents said this is what's best for me or I have a family here already so this is where I need to be this is what I need to to, to stay and take care of but during all that time they were miserable they were so sad they were in pain there, there, there was there was no healing going on there was no changes happening in the masculine's life no changes nothing all because they were hanging on to something that they lied to themselves about so they couldn't heal they couldn't change they couldn't transform but they're getting over it like i said they're healing they are five of swords so you see all this confusion you see all this darkness you see all, all this struggle that they've been through that's why they couldn't see something had to trigger them to change Something has to. What about this four of cups in the reverse? Why is the four of cups in the reverse, please, Father God? Why are they coming out of this misery? What's going on here? Hey! Hey! <laughs> hey! Why are they coming out of this misery? Because that connection is broken. Because again, they realize they weren't doing themselves justice. They settled for a two of cups by pushing their ten of cups away. Because they thought that situation was their big opportunity. So now, now that they're telling themselves some truth, look at this, the Hierophant. So it was definitely a, a, another relationship. It was definitely another relationship. Mm -hmm. You see, every time we talk about them and another relationship, the permanent one comes in. The Ten of Cups, the Ten of Pentacles. So they gave up on the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles for society, for their own beliefs, for their insecurities, for how they were taught. But something is changing. Something is changing and, and what's changing is that they're going through this transformation. They're, this is a powerful message here. So your divine masculines are changing. They're realizing that the grass isn't greener on the other side here. They're realizing the only reason they were stuck over there is because of their massive load of insecurities. Even if there were children involved, they're realizing it's like they have been using this as an excuse. And that's why they're still not happy. Because even though they chose, okay, I'll stay here for the child, the children, there was still no happiness. So they felt empty. And I always tell you guys, when you're sad, whenever you're feeling down, your children, they can feel it too. So these masculines, they realize that I'm not doing my child any justice. Because they can look on that child's face or children's faces and see the sadness that they are projecting onto their children. Or because they didn't have that self-love. Or because they were hanging on to something that wasn't serving them. What about this son, please? Tell me more about this transformation. The king of wands. That's it, man. Now they're seeing more clearly. Now they have that strength. Now they are seeing who this perfect person is. 1441. Now this divine masculine is seeing where their stability lies. And this person is the energy before the empress. So this divine feminine is working on themselves. That's what triggered the masculine. To now be working on themselves. Oh baby. And that's what's going to allow your divine masculine. To transform. To get control over their life. And to move towards who? 
their divine feminine that's becoming an empress. It's that sudden change. Oh, look what's underneath that. Rushing back towards their Ten of Cups. Give me more on this Three of Cups and why it's in the reverse here, please. Your masculines can now see the truth. Your, your person is becoming the masculine that you have been longing for, waiting for. Three of Cups in the reverse. No joy, no happiness because they're miserable. They're stressed out. They're not feeling the love that they once felt with you. And this person is now thinking of moving away with this Three of Wands. They're thinking of moving away to find their happiness. To find their peace. Because there's no peace. They're not having any peace. They're not having any peace. And here's the same Ten of Swords. They're not having any peace. So they got to end this. They got to end this. And the fact, damn man. See, everything is just repeating here. They have the answers. They know where they should be, where they should be. There's the key. They have the answers. I should just do what I need to do and get out of here. And I know that I will get out of, of my misery, get out of my suffering, get out, get out of my loss. But they stuck themselves there. Insecurities. It's hard to fight insecurities. That's why the masculines, they cannot fight these karmic people karmic situations alone the divine feminines have to be strong first that's the only way they'll conquer these feelings when the divine feminine changes and that's what's happening with this feminine showing them their ten of cups and their ten of pentacles that they made the wrong choice and you don't do it by this is what you should do masculine you should have been here you should have this no you do it by you working on yourself telling yourself what I need to change, what I need to do for me. Not because I want the masculine, but because I what I want for myself. What I think I deserve, I'm going to work towards it. What about this temperance and why it's in the reverse? The hanged man. The hanged man. And I did see the hanged man before. So they're releasing this insecurity. They're releasing all these... I, I do, I, I, I'm blaming everything on everything else instead of myself. They're waking up. They're seeing the light. When this man comes out here, this king of wands, this is like the scale has fallen from their eyes and they can now see clearly. You see that lion behind them? That's the power that they now have. That's that spiritual power that they are now having because now they can see with their third eye. Now they're transforming. Now they're becoming that emperor. And the knight of wands. Look at all that passion. Look at all that desire. Look at all that happiness. So they're rushing towards you with all that power. The eight of cups. So they're leaving their old life behind. They're leaving huh? the misery behind. And they're rushing in. The knight of swords was the next energy. Yeah, you see what's in their heart, realizing I kept myself stuck, realizing I'm the reason why I'm stuck here. But like I said, with this hangman, they are spiritually awakening. And God is helping them to take the veil off their eyes. To unhinge themselves from their insecurities. And they're going to be moving forward. They're going to be moving forward. Let's get some truth on your message. Father God, give me some truth on this 911 message, please. You have intimidated by you. Yeah. Avoiding commitment will not commit. You see what I, what I was saying? Financial loss. Seeking tarot advice. So now your divine masculines are awakening. And on the bottom it says, they will return. This person will return. This is kind of like the Libra message that I did before. And job award promotion. So things are definitely going to change. Especially for those ones who are experiencing financial difficulties as well. Things are about to change. And a past lover return. 
and this person will return. That's more confirmation than you need. <laughs> That's more confirmation than you need. One was enough. Now you got two. This person is returning for those of you who this 911 message belongs to. And you won't know until it happens. Because this is what's coming. This has been your message, everyone. To purchase your book or a reading, go to twindyflamed.square.site for your bracelets, your keychains, your bath bombs, body butters, incense, lotions, your precious stone jewelry. How could I forget? To help you with whatever it is, this is the blockage removal bracelets. And you get your mantras as well to go with those. Check the description box for all the links to my website. And guys, thank you so much for your support. Love you all. Don't forget to follow me over there on TikTok and Instagram as well. Love you guys. Like one like God. Later.